channel today's video as you can see from the title it is going to be i believe i'm going to title this like a new year reset um we're going to be resetting everything for the new year upcoming for 2024 if you're new here hey girl my name is akira janae don't forget to subscribe and join the family before you leave so i do have a walmart pickup and a sam's club pickup today at between my window is 1 to 2 p.m so we're just going to go ahead and start off with groceries and i'm going to literally throw out everything that's in my refrigerator right now <laughs> um it's not much in there anyway because i normally shop for like maybe about like two weeks at a time is how much i get groceries for so we're going to be doing not a lot of cleaning but we're going to be cleaning up getting my house refreshed for the new year i'm not going to be taking down all of my christmas decorations simply because they say it's bad luck to take down your tree or whatever before the new year. So I, I'm going to keep my tree up. But some of the other home decor items, I may start taking those down throughout this week. And then next Monday will be actually New Year's Day. So I'm going to take my tree down next week. But this vlog is going to just be over a span of this week. I'm not going to be doing all of this New Year reset in one day because that would be extremely too much. So we're going to be a little bit of deep cleaning, but just cleaning um grocery shopping i'm going to be planning for the new year we're just going to get our life together in an order for the new year so i'm super excited to do this video for me and for you but definitely for me to kind of just get my life together because after the holidays and stuff like everything is just scattered so i do have a lot of planning to do i have a lot of editing to do and that's with youtube my business <laughs> that's with me trying to figure out just an overall schedule with me getting back into the gym me trying to be on a schedule like with my nails i decided to start getting my nails done every first and 15th of the month so that i can just keep my schedule in order and like know when it's the next time i need to get my nails either completely new set or like a feel so i got my nails done a little bit before the 15th so i'm going to actually go get a feel on the first next week or this weekend and yeah, we're going to do a new set for the 15th. So super excited. It's 1231. I haven't got a confirmation for my order yet. Um, how about I say? Up, oh, Sam's Club pickup order is ready. <laughs> Let me get my phone, girl. <laughs> Literally just now got the confirmation. <laughs> Not even a minute ago. So Donna got Prince this new toy. If y'all saw my Christmas video for Christmas and he will not put it down. I'm also using my new wide angle lens. I'm not sure if you guys can tell, but like I'm really close to the lens and it's still like everything's far back. So I'm glad Sam's Club just told me that my order is ready for pickup because I did want to go to them first. And then I was going to shoot over to Wally World because the bulk of my order is from Sam's. Like the bulk of my groceries is from Sam's. And then it's like other little bitty knickknacks here and there for walmart so this is my first time doing a sam's pickup like i just got a sam's club car y'all know i was talking about that in the vlog maybe like two vlogs ago so i need to figure out where pickup is so i think i'm about to go ahead and head out now it's only 12 32 they said it's ready so by the time i get to sam's and they put everything in my car it'll be like one o'clock so i'm just going to head over to walmart after that super excited i do need to get my ikea bag y'all know this is how i take up my groceries and i do need to go clean out my trunk a little bit because christmas we had a lot of freaking presents and stuff and my car is a little crazy it was me my mom and my boyfriend in the car so i'm gonna be taking this bag today haven't used my this mk bag in a long while so make sure i got lotion lip gloss my wallet is in here i also got some business cards just in case some people compliment my hair i can go ahead and hand those out got my brush because my hair is straight so we're gonna have to do that and then i'm just wearing i'm gonna take this to keep in the car and i'm just wearing this pretty little thing little two-piece i really need to paint my toes but i don't think i'm going inside anywhere so i think it'll be okay because i don't want to wear no boots or nothing today like it's cold outside but only because the wind blowing it's not cold enough to really just you know be in boots and jackets and stuff i have a case for my camera but since i got this new lens on here it's not 
like when I try to open the camera again, it don't open. So this is how my camera looks now. It looks huge now. Like I feel like I'm an official YouTuber because girl, you can't tell me nothing now that I got this lens on baby, okay? So when I put my cover on, it doesn't allow me to open and close the camera, which is kind of annoying, but whatever. It's the fit, I'm wearing these. I'm looking at my toes, they are not done. I'm gonna come back and paint those today. So I gotta be extra careful with my camera because I don't got this case on and it's really freaking me out. <laughs> so I got like a death grip on this. All right, I'm about to close my room door. I don't have any trash out or anything. Prince love to get in the trash. So I'm just gonna close my room door. And then I'm gonna close my guest bathroom door because if not, he'll be up in here in the trash, girl. And I used to put this gate up, but I'm only gonna be gone like an hour. So he's straight. He gonna be in here chilling and playing. Baby, Sam's Club gas station, packed. Okay, where is pickup? I see pickup. Gas is 244 and yeah, every pump is packed, so. I think I may just stay going to Costco <laughs> because, oh, it be too many people in Sam's. I kind of want to go inside Sam's because I haven't been inside Sam's in a long while, but I also just wanted to do pickup. Why did they say loading area? Like, what is that? I don't know. I'll probably go in Sam's like when it's less chaotic, like after the holidays and stuff, but I know I definitely wanted to do a pickup because I just wanted to beat the crowd. Okay, that's Walmart pickup. I need Sam's pickup. Okay, Sam's Club app. Okay. <laughs> I'm in spot 10. <laughs> oh, this is chaotic. I'm here. I mean, I am early. My pickup ain't until 1. It's 12.48, so. And I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17 items from them. And my total is 190 four dollar pickup fee and sales tax why are y'all charging a pickup fee i don't like that so i got a rotisserie chicken he said it's gonna be a few minutes on the rotisserie chicken he put everything in there quick girl i forgot i got a rotisserie chicken what i'm about to cook with that um i got it because i saw some people use it for like chicken alfredo um you can just use you know the rotisserie chicken for anything and i also got already cooked like chicken breast and i was going to meal prep like some potatoes i got spinach um, I want to get some greens and you know like just meal prep basically I'm trying to do right for the new year and going into the new year or getting ready to go into the new year with already like pre pre prepared meals everything's prepped I'm gonna be in a routine that's kind of what I'm trying to get into so I've been going to the gym for like two weeks now consistently for like two weeks or so um, which is a lot better thank you you too Mmm. Ooh, we girl, she smells good. Mmm, mmm. That's what I'm talking about, baby. So I just went and got my eggs from out of there. Um, and I'm gonna tell them to put my stuff in the back seat. It was quick with it. I guess he fed everything in the trunk, girl. Like I said, it wasn't much. He didn't say have a good day, nice day, what have you, girl. Oh, I love this new lens. Like, oh, y'all can just see everything now. I'm about to, um, I kind of want to check and see. He had three carts of stuff. Go check and see. I'm curious. <laughs> All right, it look like everything I ordered, so girl, we got to go, okay? And I got some ice cream, eggs, and I got a lot of cold stuff. So I really gotta go. And I need to hurry up and clean out my refrigerator like really, really fast. Because, yeah, I don't want my stuff to be melting. I didn't got my stuff before both of these people. And it was pure part before me. But I did check in like way before. Some people be checking in a lot later. And what this truck doing right here though? I'm gonna get out of here because I took y'all off my mount. So I can just hurry up and get into the house when I get home like sorry why would you park right here The reason 
reason why I take my groceries up in the Ikea bag is because I gotta go upstairs. And this cart doesn't have three wheels on the back so it can just roll on top of the stairs to go up. I have to go up one stair, like one by one. So it usually takes a little bit more out of me. That's what I gotta do. Like that. So I need one with three wheels on the back. I saw one on Amazon, but I haven't got it yet. shoulder as much as when I just brought all my groceries up in this no but it's so much more upper body strength like arm power pulling it up step by step was I able to get more stuff up at a time yes either way it's a lose-lose situation because I stay upstairs so it's not that good plus I was recording the second time coming up to show y'all so it made it a little bit harder um i kind of go i take two steps up and then pull it upward like that i am going to try to go on amazon and try out the one that has three wheels on the back and see if that's better so i don't just just gotta like yank it up the stairs but if i was to try to put all of this in this bag and take this upstairs it definitely would have been heavier yes so i'm going to use my cart today unload this and then go get the rest of the stuff um, I am able to bring up more stuff with the cart, but I mean, honestly, it's kind of the same, like, you know, like manpower or woman power that you gotta, you know, put all your strength into it to get everything. So, so. I'm upstairs, I got all, all my food upstairs. The girl took four trips, four, to get all of my crap up here. I did use the little thingy three times, and then I used this bag for all of my Walmart stuff. So four times. We're gonna do a little overview and I don't do like in-depth <clears throat> grocery hauls anymore. But from Sam's Club, I'm super excited. Y'all know the only reason why I really wanted the Sam's Club um membership was to get this freaking chicken breast. This is literally only 1077 depending on how many pounds you get. But it's one, two, three, four, five, six chicken breasts in here. And I'm trying to get into meal prepping like I used to, so I'm super excited to try this and see how that tastes and then basically here's the thing for the new year and the new reset vlog and all of that i don't want to be spending as much money on food as i used to um spending as much money as i used to with a lot of stuff but food is definitely number one so i would want to i want to start meal prepping again whether that's snacks breakfast lunch dinner whatever the case may be um so therefore, like when I'm at work, I'm not downstairs spending my money in the cafeteria down there getting stuff that's not good anyway. So I might as well make my own food. And as well as here, when I'm at home, like when I leave the gym, sometimes I'm like, you know, what am I about to eat? I've been eating a lot of stuff with protein right after the gym. And I'm really trying to get my protein intake. Like I'm going to try to do like 140 grams of protein each day, but I really need to meal prep for that. So I'm just trying to build better habits. So. Yeah, I know I like to go get smoothies from Tropical Smoothie. So I wanted to go ahead and get some more strawberries and mixed fruit because ain't no telling how long I had the other frozen fruit in there. So we're gonna be doing smoothies with that. Like I said, I'm throwing everything out. So I needed some more pickles. I got this, oh girl, this rotisserie chicken. I think I already showed y'all, it was only $4.98. They said to get the rotisserie chicken from Sam's instead of Costco because the one at Costco don't be well roasted. <laughs> so. I got a wing, leg, like girl, everything. So obviously this week for the next two weeks, I'm gonna be focusing more so on chicken rather than red meats like steak, um, lamb, you know, all of that. So I'm focused on chicken for right now. I got two things of potatoes, one, two, those are from Walmart. Got some more peaches because I'm trying to intake my fruits a lot more. This is for spaghetti. I tried these at work one time and I absolutely love them. And the only people that sell them is Sam's Club. So I also wanted to get this from Sam's. I get a hundred pouches and this was like maybe $9. 
the cons that I usually get are from Walmart and they're like a pack of what like 40 or 50 for like seven dollars so it's better to get it at Sam's got Velveeta I got some frozen ice cream sandwiches just for like a snack or a cheat day I guess you can say honey buns are not for me that's for my boyfriend these are me my boyfriend whatever girl this big old thing of ketchup literally from Walmart did not know I got this big old thing of ketchup but I needed some more ketchup look at me saying I'm not gonna do a full in depth grocery haul but I'm <laughs> kind of doing one Needed some more bread also if y'all keep your bread in the refrigerator or in the um freezer comment down below because i never grew up doing that like i know that's kind of standard for like black households and stuff people be keeping in the refrigerator how long do y'all be keeping it in the refrigerator because i'm not gonna eat all of this by january 3rd like that's literally next week i'm not gonna eat all that bread so i'm gonna put one loaf keep one loaf out put one loaf up in the refrigerator or freezer so comment down below but i ain't even gonna have this video out until next weekend anyways i'm gonna go ahead and put it in the refrigerator or the freezer and we're gonna do that so got a big thing of cranberry apple from walmart got my eggs from sam's this is for bay potatoes fettuccine i got my bacon from sam's club i used to eat this bacon all the time got a big thing of strawberries because i do want to do a fruit bowl and i got my cream of chicken i like the heart healthy kind but we just gonna have to rock out with this it was a better deal chicken broth i got the variety pack of cran apple cranberry and cran grape i'm going to be taking these with my lunch to work or you know just taking these on the go so like i'm going to keep this here and then i'll be able to take these on the go i got a big old pack of my fiji water girl it's like a what 24 <laughs> what is this maybe 24 packs i don't know girl got this though and then I got, uh, y'all know I love my Velveeta mac and cheese. I think this is an eight pack. I got the Sprite minis, 30 cans. I got some pizza. And then these, y'all know I love this brand from Costco. Sam's only had the chicken strips or the chicken tenders. They didn't have the chicken nuggets, but they did have chicken nuggets in that other brand that's supposed to be another Chick-fil-A dupe. But I like that brand. Like, I don't wanna switch up on my brands like i just like the just beer brand so these are the um actual chicken nuggets but i like this brand so i just decided to get the chicken strips as well and yeah that's pretty much my haul that's everything oh i got some spinach up here let me close this this is some uh, black forest ham girl it looks so good i'm gonna be making sandwiches as well and then y'all know I do like spinach. The only type of vegetables I like is spinach and greens. So I am gonna get me some greens as well. And hopefully my aunt sent me the recipe so I can start making those. But this is a big thing of spinach. I'm gonna keep half out and I'm gonna freeze the other half because it says best if used by January 1st. So today we're gonna be planning out my meals. Oops. We're gonna be planning out my meals as well to try to figure out what I wanna eat, what I need to freeze, what I don't need to freeze, and we're gonna be meal prepping as well in this video, so.
Lady Kane for the day. So it's 3.15. Um, I put up all of my um, refrigerated items in the refrigerator, in the freezer, in the refrigerator. Um, it's 3.15. I did not eat breakfast or anything when I woke up this morning. I'm literally starving. So like I said, today is the day after Christmas. I'm about to finish a plate of my leftovers. So I got mac and cheese, greens, ham from two of my aunt's places, a little bit left of rib, and some mashed potatoes. And then... I have a little bit more ham turkey left, um, greens from my other aunt's house. I got a pork chop and a little bit more mashed potatoes. So I'm going to finish up my leftovers for today. And then like I'm done with the Christmas food or whatever. And then tomorrow I'm going to actually cook and try to meal prep and see what I want to do. So yeah, like I said, we're not doing everything in one day. That'd be crazy to be trying to do this whole reset in one day. If you want to go ahead, but I don't recommend um, especially because it's not even the new year yet for me. So I'm just going to take it a couple days at a time and it's only going to be like a three day vlog. So I'm about to watch, um, Chelsea's vlog right now. And then this is only 16 minutes. So I'll probably watch this eat and then finish putting up all of the, um, grocery stuff. Eggs, potatoes. We just been drinking like and cooking. So yeah, Feature. So I just got done eating my leftovers or whatever and I'm about to put up the rest of my food. Why did I just pull out my hamburger buns out the pantry like to make some room? And it got to me thinking like, oh, like I got to use these hamburger buns before January 3rd because they're going to expire. And I'm like, oh yeah, that's why uh, I um, got some hamburger meat today from grocery shopping or whatever. And then I get to looking. Baby, I don't got no more bags. <laughs> and there's nothing else left in my car. And I'm like, I could have sworn I bought some hamburger meat. And then I was just watching Kyra. And she opened up her vlog with some cookies that she baked. And I'm like, I've been craving some cookies since, you know, a few days ago. And I'm like, didn't I order some cookies? Then I got to think, like, didn't I order this, this, and this? Girl, they left out one, two, three, four, five, six seven eight of my items from my walmart pickup that's why i'm like girl now i'm about to start checking all of my stuff because i don't got time and it's funny because i got out and i looked to make sure that like all my bed like i thought i was just checking to make sure like it was enough room in my trunk why did they leave out two cans of my biscuits my cheese two things of my smoked sausage a lunchable ground beef that i was going to make sandwich with and my chocolate chip cookies <laughs> like uh and i wanted i had to go back to walmart anyway because i wanted to get some robitussin but i'm like oh, i didn't really want to go back today but i mean i probably won't i don't know i'll just go back tomorrow but i get a total refund of 19 dollars and 65 cents um i just went through it on walmart it says your refund is on, on your way sorry things didn't work out we've initiated the refund and wanted to prove and wanted to provide a quick overview for you so it said it's going to take up to like three days with a gift card 10 days 10 days for credit cards and seven days for um debit cards so whatever i'm just going to use my gift card i got a 50 dollars gift card from christmas for walmart so we're about to stock up the rest of my stuff I'm pissed off right now Hunt. These are 
these containers are from the home edit i'll probably link them down below if i can but no a hundred packs of fruit snacks this is literally insane <laughs> focus on cleaning up and straightening up my apartment for tomorrow tomorrow is my last off day and then i go to work for two days and then i'm off saturday and sunday so i think tomorrow i do want to try to wake up early to um start planning first answering emails um to get my collaborations and everything in order for the new year and see what i'm about to be doing for the upcoming year um as well as planning for the new year and i also need to go to walmart in the morning to get the rest of the items that they didn't give me and then get some robitussin and then whatever else i may need in there to use my new gift card so i'm just going to give y'all an overview of the apartment like i don't want to do too too much cleaning in this one um but yeah i think i want to just go ahead and get everything cleaned back up because Christmas presents made my house a mess and then me doing this restock got my apartment looking a mess as well so I'm gonna give y'all an overview of everything and then I'll show y'all how it looks when everything is clean this is how the aftermath is looking so I gotta go throw all of this away my living room isn't too bad I gotta put my bag and stuff somewhere just straighten up a little bit in here and I need to take trash out and then I need to clear off my island as well. Put this cleaning stuff away. I kind of already cleaned up over here, so we're good. I'll probably do some laundry tonight as well. And honestly, that'll be all because I do want to try to edit my Christmas vlog from yesterday. And I really wanted to get that up today because, I mean, you know, it's Christmas. People ain't really going to be watching Christmas stuff for too much longer. So in this room, we're just going to worry about this in a separate vlog. So yeah i'm about to go ahead and take prints out and take whatever i can to the dumpster as much as i can and then tomorrow i'll take the rest of the stuff in the morning and yeah that's all i'm gonna do for today like i said we're not gonna do everything in one day and trash all around it so I'm just gonna have to put this by the dumpster <laughs>
Wednesday, December 27th. I just got back from Wally World and checking my mail. And I'm trying to upload this Christmas vlog for y'all today, but it got a copyright <laughs> flag on there. So if you care about this, it literally says basically it cannot be monetized. Um, but my fan, my channel is not affected, but the copyright claim is only for a few seconds, like from three minutes and 41 seconds to three minutes and 53 seconds. So we're about to see, it starts right here. My I don't do it. Oh, it's my song. The Christmas tree. Alexa, So right here, we're just gonna mute all sound when the song plays. I can try to mute the song, but that takes a lot longer. So we're just gonna mute the whole sound and we're gonna continue. Mute, cause it's 116, I plan to post the video at three, my normal uploading time. And it's processing, I can leave this page. So we're gonna return to the upload and then we're gonna wait for that to process. So I used my Walmart gift card. My Walmart total was $56.95. Well, $58, so I only pay $8 out of my own money because I had a $50 Walmart gift card for Christmas. So we're gonna do a little haul. I got some more paper plates. I haven't had paper, well, plastic plates um, in a long while. <laughs> I've just been using my dishes, but I'm tired of having to do dishes repeatedly and it just, you know, it just becomes a lot. So I decided to get a pack of 50 as well. I think this is my man right there coming in, period. <laughs> so I can like, from my apartment, I can see the kind of like mini little like hallway and I can see when people rolling in from what, yep, that's him looking at his location. <laughs> so anyways, I got some grapes. We're gonna meal prep today as well. I just got some Lunchables ham and cheese and nacho cheese for like a quick little snack. I got a mixed berry yogurt, this brand. I actually kind of really like this one. So I'm either gonna put this in a smoothie or put some fruit over it. And then I got some biscuits because I'm doing chicken and dumplings on Saturday. I'm off Saturday. I got some ground beef. I also got some more Lunchables ham and cheese. Y'all know I was telling y'all my cookies, I got those. Basically, I went and bought everything that they didn't give me yesterday from my Walmart pickup. I planned out my meals and my day, well, my week. Um, today is Wednesday, so I just started on Wednesday all the way up until next Tuesday. So that's a little overview. I got my whole week planned out and scheduled. And then this is what I use. These are from Five Below. They were like $3. This is what I use to plan my meals for the week. So for breakfast, I normally always cook like bacon, eggs. Um, I probably have some fruit since I got a lot of fruit, like a fruit bowl, um, toast, you know, just regular breakfast food. So I'm not meal prepping any of that because I just cook that. It takes like 10, 15 minutes. Lunch, I want to do 
chicken alfredo with spinach i'm doing that tonight i got a big thing of spinach i'm gonna do chicken steak and hibachi with you know eggs and spinach and stuff that's gonna be one of my meal preps for lunch dinner i'm gonna do chicken and dumplings on saturday i'm actually cooked that i'm not meal prepping that i'm gonna do chicken breast roasted potatoes maybe a side of spinach um and some mac and cheese for a dinner and that's all that i'm gonna meal prep for this week because i can't really eat leftovers like that like i have to meal prep for like maybe two to three days at a time and then i'll do another meal prep of food so that's what we're going to be meal prepping today i'm super excited i'm going to put these groceries away and stuff i'll probably talk to bay for about an hour or so before i actually start cooking i haven't ate today i'm going to eat probably some leftover ham and stuff from christmas today is wednesday christmas was monday so really all i got is ham to eat and i'm just going to finish that out and be done because baby y'all know I, I, I just can't be doing it holiday leftovers like this, so I think I hear him. So, yeah. I'm about to put this in the oven. Hey! Don't you talk like him. You run him! OMG! Yeah, I just got home from Walmart. I just got this. Oh my gosh, y'all! <laughs> so, I'm going to be putting my fruit into these little glass jars for like a little on the go mini what like a fruit fruit cup i guess you can say and it's a spot to where you can put the date and stuff oh i'm so glad you remember uh, you, are, you don't need any of these who am i kid you ain't gonna use them. <laughs> <laughs> not who am i kid so yeah i got a whole pack girl because i had bought some from dollar tree dollar tree they're a little bit bigger but i only bought two so i needed a lot more so i'm so glad you brought these Oh, I'm super excited now. All right, so me and Bae just got back from my office from getting this package. I'm about to open it up and make sure I got everything that I... You are so extra. You could have just walked. <laughs> now you got him lit. <laughs> I'm about to make sure she ain't got me all of my stuff. I'm going to do like an in-depth she in like haul or something in another vlog. Because I got like household items as well as clothes and all kinds of stuff so i'm just gonna open it to make sure i got everything and then after i do this i'm gonna cook the chicken alfredo for me and bae dinner tonight and then i'm gonna start my meal preps oh let me get a thumbnail pic oh i'm so excited Got me some new house shoes that I needed. starving the chicken from sam's definitely top tier so good mm, mm, mm. Mm, mm, mm. gives it an extra little flavor until they put rosemary on the chicken i smelled it when i even opened up the thing so it tastes really good though um if i'm gonna eat it like i plan to put that chicken breast with some roasted potatoes and some macaroni and stuff so I'm going to probably try to find me a sauce to add with this since I'm eating it with like obviously pasta. I'm going to need kind of some type of sauce when I just eat the chicken breast. And this is a big old piece of chicken breast. I ain't going to even eat all that. Mm, mm, mm. And I cooked the chicken breast in the... I forgot to cook the chicken breast in the skillet, so I cooked it in that pan or that pot. 
like to warm it up it's already cooked but of course it's been in the refrigerator since yesterday and i wanted to make sure you know it was heated up and stuff i was going to put it on the top of it like the restaurants but i just mix it all together because that's how i like it and i also added spinach and a few smoked sausages Try to incorporate spinach a lot more or just greens in general and the only thing i like is spinach and greens update um it's 6 29 in the evening um bay is gone for i think i told y'all uh rehearsal for church um so i'm gonna just sit here on the couch and answer emails until he comes back and then we're gonna watch our show um i know i was supposed to meal prep today but honestly i don't think that's gonna happen which is cool because i told y'all this is not a race <laughs> I'll probably wake up in the morning after I get done. Either I'll cook breakfast or he'll cook breakfast. Um, we're going to eat breakfast. I don't got to go to work until later that night. Um, so I'll probably go ahead and start meal prepping tomorrow. Because I do actually need to tear apart their rotisserie chicken and do something with that. Um, so yeah, we're going to do that. To I'm going to do that tomorrow. Tonight we're going to focus on emails. And then I'm going to focus on i need nine videos to post for january if i do my regular sunday through thursday then that's nine videos total if i do like only sundays obviously that's four videos so i don't know really what i want to do for the new year like i don't have a plan for my content or what i want to do but i was thinking i think i told you i was thinking of doing like weekly vlogs and if I do weekly vlogs, then like that vlog would specifically be every Sunday. If I don't do weekly vlogs, then it's just going to be, you know, regular vlogging or whatever and like regular videos. But I, I really want to try to do the weekly vlogs, but it's like I don't be doing enough stuff through the week, honestly, girl, to even be vlogging weekly. I may do like a weekly vlog maybe like once or twice out of the month. I don't know we'll see we'll see what the new year brings but yeah i'm trying to i'm trying to figure out how i want to do my content and schedule out content and stuff like that um i do have some content ideas for next month so i'm just going to jot those videos down and then kind of figure out what day i want to record or like you know just different things like that so i got my macbook i have the 2017 macbook air so we've been rocking with her since 2017 and this little cover and stuff is linked in my Amazon storefront. I talked about that in my Amazon favorites uh, video. But I'm going to answer emails on my phone. It's just quicker for me to do it from my phone. And then the reason why I got my MacBook is because, girl, as y'all can see, it says 1900 freaking emails. Let me turn down my brightness. I have 1,940 emails. And, girl no ma'am so after i answer the ones i want to answer i like to kind of go to my um search bar in the gmail app and like let's say i get a lot of stuff from let's just say she in i'll search she in and then delete all of that stuff so in my case i get a lot of notifications from my bank so i will type type in like chase and then i will literally just delete everything from chase because like that's too many emails girl here so i already have a message kind of like pre-typed out so i like to uh, please stop <laughs> i already have a message typed out in my notes so all i do is copy that message <laughs> all i do you get out because you messing up my stuff all I do is copy this message and then I literally just tweak it to whatever the brand is kind of asking me. So it's a lot faster for me to do that on my phone rather than doing it on the computer. And I just fly through it. So I have not responded back to collaborations in a long minute. Like I had, I responded to some earlier this month, but I never followed up to like really get the product sent to me, if that makes sense. Like they accepted my price or I accepted their price and then that kind of was just it. Hey 
Hey y'all. Um, today is Thursday, December 28th. It's 4 30 in the afternoon, and I've been just laying around in bed all day. Um, Bay had left probably about an hour ago. He fixed me breakfast in bed and stuff, so we've just been chilling watching our show on Netflix called um, Sweet Magnolia or Sweet Magnolias. It's a really good show. We're on season two. Um, so yeah, I gotta go to work today <laughs> and I'm probably going to pick up tomorrow and since this check is going to be what I'm going to use for rent, I probably really need to pick up Saturday as well, um, unless somebody buys some hair before then, <laughs> but I know I'm going to have to probably pick up Friday for sure. I could use my PTO for yesterday. I called in, um, but PTO hours, they don't, since I work night shift, we don't get like the extra night shift like pay. So yeah, I don't know. We're going to see it but i probably will definitely end up picking up friday saturday is still debatable um, but we'll see but since i do work tonight i did want to go ahead and start meal prepping um i have not done anything today so i got two pots on i'm going to cook some macaroni and i'm probably going to do some mashed potatoes really quickly because i'm going to go ahead and eat the chicken breast i do have the rotisserie chicken and i'm cooking dumplings on a saturday but i don't really know what else i'm going to use that rotisserie chicken Four. so i think next time i do this meal prep situation i'm only going to buy the um chicken breast instead of the rotisserie chicken like the rotisserie chicken i was thinking of doing some type of like chicken uh like chicken tacos chicken wrap type thing and of course i'm going to use that for chicken and dumplings but other than that i don't really know what i want to put that in but the chicken breast i am going to be using it a lot more i see that now so yeah, we're just gonna meal prep. I got two, four, six. I got six of these little bitty mason jars already taken out. I'm about to wash them out. Um, I'm gonna be making a big fruit bowl and then I'm gonna distribute them into these little mason jars. And then I'm gonna take one of these to work with me. And I'm also gonna be taking my um, chicken breast. I'm gonna do mashed potatoes and macaroni. I may do some spinach as well, but we'll see. But I only have like an hour and 30 minutes to kinda prep this stuff i did buy i wanted to finally use this the ecos plant powered fruit and vegetable wash great for soaking you can rinse away the wax oil and unseen dirt from your stuff so i kind of wanted to use this it says shake well spray the produce rub lightly for 20 to 30 seconds then rinse for leafy veggies leaf spray on soak in water it contains natural ingredients whatever so only five ingredients, water, alcohol, the something, plant derived solvent, um, some other stuff, some other stuff, and some other stuff. So
53 and I still gotta take prints freaking outside. I got the dishwasher going. I am about to leave a little, a little dishes in the sink. That's messy, but I'll clean in the morning when I get off. Cause girl, I gotta go. But I got my meal prep. I got two with meat in there, and then this one just have two sides in it. I'm gonna put the rotisserie chicken in this one. But I'm about to put both of these into the refrigerator along with the fruit that's in here. Um, I need to figure out how I'm gonna store everything because right now it's not yet. <laughs> so, I need to put the meal preps in the bigger part of the refrigerator and then everything else elsewhere. So, yeah, I don't know really where to put this. I'm going to put this up top for now, my two little meal preps. So, I got dinner for tomorrow, which will be Friday. And then Saturday, I plan to cook dumplings. So, then I'm going to eat the roasted potatoes and the macaroni for lunch on Saturday. And that's all that I'm doing. And then I'm also going to have the rotisserie chicken. But I need to freeze that and do something with that tomorrow. So right now, to work, I'm going to take my little fruit cup right here. I got a cranberry grape and I got a Sprite because I'll be thirsty. <laughs> and then we're going to take, I'm going to take two fruit snacks. Got my meal prep. I got my big lunch box right here. And then... I think that's all. I got some cheeses and stuff for another snack, but I think I'm just going to take that. Um, I might take a couple Reese's or something, but yeah, I got to go, girl, because <laughs> I got to walk print still, and I only got five minutes. I like, excuse me, I like to leave the house at 6. Um, I don't got to be there at 6.30, but I like to kind of, look, cheese is right here. I wonder if these still good. But um, yeah, I like to leave the house a little bit early so I can get there, you know, just, just to be settled. And I really need a bigger lunch box so I can really sit these in here how I want to sit them in here. I don't want it. Like it fits, but not exact. Like, cause it's coming open. Ugh. And then I don't want to, I mean, I can put it like this, but then I mean, I'm gonna have to put my lunch box in, <laughs> laying down like, ugh. I need like smaller bowls or I need a bigger, I'm going to do it like this. Okay, not that far down. And then we're going to put my stuff in here. And my, I hate to put it on kind of warm food. Oh, I just got it. the ice pack. So I'm going to put my ice pack right here on the top of the fruit so that can stay cold and keep the drinks cold all right and then my fruit snacks i like to put that on the side of my lunch boxes got my phone charger lip gloss and it's time for me to go girl all the stuff is all unplug the air fryer all right i'll talk to y'all in the morning